So just looking at your two games from this past weekend, was there anything different that sticks out? Well, I think the, the Friday night game, we weren't quite ready to play. All right, and so the, the message is, is, you know, always we have to have that little bit of an edge to us. Um, yes, we can get our work in during practice, but never take anything for granted. And so um, I was pleased with our, our, our ability to bounce back on Saturday night. We clearly had a lot more energy and, uh, and got the win. Um, you're starting to get some more team chemistry. Um, who are you really seeing improvements from, and what are those improvements? Well, I've seen improvement in, in C.J. Fair over the last week to ten days. Um, and he's an important piece for us, right? He's our only rookie. Um, he's come in uh, and worked really hard, and I think he's now starting to see uh, see the benefits of it. Uh, you have Sioux Falls tomorrow. How has this team improved since you uh, went out there a couple of weeks ago? Well, I think teams are both teams are different. Um, They've added some more talent to their roster. They currently have three Miami Heat players uh, down, um, and they they destroyed Iowa the other night in a very lopsided game. So uh, they like to play fast. That's one thing that hasn't changed, but I think they have better talent now. Um, we've changed as well. We've had uh, NBA players down uh, and back, and, and right now we've got Russ and, and, um, and Glenn still. So... Uh, we have to continue to do what we do best, and that's defend at a high level, um, take away threes that Miami uh, and Sioux Falls will try to try to shoot, um, and play uh, extremely physical. Let's see. So you guys split your two games with Grand Rapids this past week, and what was working better in Saturday's win? Um, I just think our approach was better. It was, it was more focused. Um, I think the first night we were maybe a little too relaxed, and uh, they took it to us. They took it to us, and uh, the next night we came in with a better uh, approach, uh, made our adjustments, stuck to the game plan, and came out victorious. Uh, did you feel like you wanted to get, have more after Friday's heartbreak? Like, did you want to avenge that loss? Absolutely, absolutely. More so, we was uh, more so upset with ourselves. Uh, like I say, our approach wasn't what it needed to be, and uh, we want um, we committed to. Uh, coming in with a with a better approach and better mindset, stuck to the game plan, and we executed on defense and offense. And now you have um, you've seen Sioux Falls twice this year so far. And uh, how has the team gotten better since your last game? Um, to my knowledge, um, I know they're shooting about like probably some of the best in the league right now. Um, they have a few NBA guys. They have uh, good guards and uh, a son White Sox is playing at a very high level. Um, so we, we just have to be prepared for, for what they, the schemes they throw at us and uh, the inside presence. How do you think the Mad Ants have improved since you last played in Sioux Falls? Um, we, we're picking up the system a lot uh, better. Um, we're getting the flow of things a lot better. Um, um, it's just with time, with time we're just knowing each other better, executing, throwing in different plays here and there, mixing it up a little bit, and guys are getting their rhythm. And then we're um, coming together on defensive end, most importantly.